2000 and today we're going fishing. It's gorgeous out here. It's a little bit cool, not cold, cool. And it's, it's a little windy, so you might have trouble, but we're gonna do some fishing. This is not far from our house. So we thought we'd come here and check it out. It's so pretty. So we're gonna do fishing here. I might go over here and do some because he wants to probably come here and then that way he can sit on the bench because he forgot his chair. So um, anywhere else, I don't know. It is not a big place. It's a small park and it is a public park. So there's a bench right there. This got destroyed at picnic table um, from the tree falling over the hurricane. And they haven't cleaned it up yet. They need to. But these tree people are very busy right now. So, and there's Shea Bear over there getting his rod going. And I'll probably just fish over here some more. Put my rod in here. That way he can do his thing. I'll have to fish out there somewhere and try it there. It is shallow here, but with the water up, it might be okay. Hopefully I won't get stuck. And it looks like they've been pulling out the weeds around here. So that's a good thing. Yeah, so. Anyways, we'll set up and then we'll come back. Okay, I threw my rod in and hopefully we'll get something. Even if it's a small fish, I don't care. As long as I catch something, that's all I care about. I'm using shrimp. I like to use shrimp. But these, these shrimp that we got, we got it down at the uh, fishing place around the corner from us. And they're really big. So I don't know. I think a lot of these fish in here are probably pretty small. I don't know. We will see. So. I'm just going to put it down. I do better when I leave it alone and not move it. Let's see if I can get something. You never know. Okay, guys. These guys came up and they're putting gas in that thing. I don't know what you call them. But they're for, um, you know, uh, getting the weeds out. That's what they're doing. Not on. So he's trying to see if I can zoom in it a little bit. You guys can see. There you go. Yeah, interesting. Yeah, the guy's climbing up that thing, whatever that is. Very interesting. Huh. Always something happening. I'll leave you guys on for a few minutes so you guys can see what is happening. Not on. I hope I got my mic on. Yeah, I do. Yeah. I haven't caught nothing. I'm not even getting a bite. And I got shrimp on this sucker, so shrimp usually does pretty good. But I don't know. I'll just let it film for a few minutes so you guys can watch this. Yep. I think they're going to take it out. put gas in it. If they um, move it, I will come back.
The man doesn't know how to work it. Hmm. I think that younger guy knows how to work it better than the old guy. <laughs> yes, they're taking it out. Yep, they're going to go out. There they go. I hope they don't get tangled up in my rod. That's cool. Cool, huh? That is cool. At least we know they're doing the likes. Very nice. All right, I'm going to move my rod, make sure it's okay, and I'll come back when I get something, if I find something. Now, this got all stirred up, so it probably scared whatever was here anyways. I don't know. Okay, guys, this thing's coming back in. I reeled my fishing rod in for a moment here it comes as you can see there it is again so this thing's gonna scare the fish away so i didn't get any bites before they came anyways not really i don't know maybe a little bit but they might have been very tiny fish um but this guy's like coming in here and I don't know what he wants to do, if he wants to go somewhere else or just keep hanging here. He's going to attach that thing, I think, on the back. And we'll just sit here and watch him, since we can't fish. it back. I don't know what he was doing, cleaning it, checking it out. I don't know. He was out there for a little bit, but not for very long. I don't know.
Strange. I don't understand what he was doing, really. I don't know if he was just checking it out, making sure it's working. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. So, if anything else comes by, I'll turn you back on. Okay, guys, so we've relocated. We are on the, what do they call this place, babe? It's called Deer something on this road, but um, Deer, Deer River, D River. Anyway, so we came out, we decided to come over this way because we weren't catching nothing and we've had, we've had good luck here. So we thought we haven't been here for a while. They're not far apart from each other. Neither one of them, so. If we catch something, we will come back. Okay, guys, so I had one, and I got off the hook and took the hook, bit the thing. So Shea Bear put another hook on for me. Then I had something else because it um, took my shrimp. So there's something in here that's, you know, taking my shrimp. So we got something in here. But could it be a turtle? It could be. You just never know. So I'm gonna reel this up a little bit because it's not tight enough. See if I get something. I don't know. So. Turtles, a lot of turtles in here. So it could be a turtle that's doing it. So, I don't know. As soon as I turn you off, I might get something. I don't know. So I'll keep you on for a few minutes. Birds behind me are chirping, they're in the woods. <laughs> I don't mind coming over here. It's pretty cool. It's quiet. The other place was a little bit noisier, especially when that grass thing was in there. So, and you know, when they do that, they stir up everything and the fish just take off. <laughs> so, we thought we'd try over here for a little bit. All right, I'll turn you guys off for a bit. Well, guys, we didn't catch anything. I still have my rod in there, but it, it's nothing. We didn't catch a thing. But when I first came out, I think I had something. I think it was a turtle, if you want to know the truth. After that, it just never happened. <laughs> I caught lots of seaweed. Yeah, weeds. And uh, that's about it. So, anyways, guys, Monkey says she's out, and... I'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all.